Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 43, and this is war number 9. And we're going up against an alliance called Planet of the Symbiotes. I like that name. Okay, okay. Is Null there? You know, Null gotta be there, right? Anyway, let's see who they have banned. Okay, White Magneto, Warlock, and Omega Sentinel. Interesting. I wonder what traps they have planned for us. Let's take a look. Let's take a look here. I take path three. And ooh. Okay, so we've got... Um, whew, I hate fighting him. I really do. He is so annoying. Um, but I'm, I, let me think here. I'm thinking Claire. Because um, let me take a look real quick here. Um, Defender. Okay, yeah, I got auto block. Okay, yeah, yeah. If nullified, goes on cooldown, okay. I don't think he gets any armor ups. Okay, yeah, I'm not seeing any armor ups. So, Claire can do this fight. Now, let's see, Moon Dragon. Okay, uh-huh. Immunity, okay. Reduce the potency, don't care about that. Um, okay, yeah. I'm just looking for armor ups and I don't remember her getting any, but I've been surprised before by someone, especially some of the newer champions, uh, where they'll get an armor up and I'm like, where did they just get an armor up? Okay, so looks like she doesn't get armor ups either. So that looks like a Claire fight. Okay. Um, so already I'm thinking of bringing Claire in. Now we've got Gore here. And Claire can usually beat Gore. So if needed, I could probably take that Gore with Claire. Okay. Um, but let's see. Oh, okay. We've got Kate Bishop and Korg in the middle. Mm -mm. Don't like that node because it's got root. Um, but we've got a bishop here. Interesting. And I see now why they uh, banned um, the Magneto and the uh, Warlock. However... Let me think. Who would I use if I have to take him? Um, I might have to talk this over with my team, but I would probably take him with maybe Overseer. I would probably do that. And then we've got Spot. Oh, man, not Spot. Oh, and then we've got Nimrod. So already I'm going to do Hulkling. Future Ant-Man. Ooh, over there. That could be a pain, but Hulkling might be able to do that fight. So Claire and Hulkling, for sure. However, this Spot is annoying. Now, Spot doesn't get armor ups, but he's just an annoying fighter. So I would just bring in a counter for him. I might have to take um, Nick Fury off of uh, Alliance Quest, because I've been using him in Alliance Quest, and bring him over here for this spot. That might be what I need to do. And if that's the case, um, Nick Fury could probably do uh, that fight as well. So Nick Fury, Claire, and Hulkling are what I'm thinking of right now, which means somebody else needs to take uh, that bishop and I could probably do Gore and possibly uh, future Ant-Man. 
All right, let's see what we got over here. Ooh. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't see anybody that I would feel confident really dealing with. Um, if Nick Fury has good health and all that good stuff, possibly this one. But I wouldn't want to mainly because of the conflictor. Um, the next debuff. Hmm. Um, hmm. Yeah. Um, Claire might be able to. We'll have to see. We'll have to see, um, how that goes. But, uh, I would probably not want to deal with with that one. Definitely not that Mangog. Uh, let me see. Anybody over here? Yeah, no. I mean, Nick can do that. Hulkling, maybe. Man, that, I, mm, no, not that one. Will not be messing with him on that node. No, sir. All right. So Claire, Hulkling, and Nick Fury is what it's looking like. And unless I'm missing something, um, the future Ant-Man, maybe. We'll see if somebody has a better uh, option for him. Um... Yeah, we'll see if there's a better option, but Hulkling or Nick Fury uh, for that fight. Nick Fury definitely for that spot. Hulkling for that uh, Nimrod. And Claire for everything else. All right. We'll see how it goes. Let's get on with the fighting. All right, going in with Nick Fury, Claire, and Hulkling. And uh, I think I had uh, a few more fights than I usually do. But as you'll see, easy work. When you have the right counters, that is. So the first fight is Nova. I remember how much of a pain Nova is. Very, very annoying. But I had to fight him. I forget which map it was in Alliance Quest. But I had to fight Nova every single time in Alliance Quest. So I ended up learning how to evade his specials. Because up until that time, I wasn't able to evade his specials. Especially the special two. And it would rip me apart. And I think on this node, he was unblockable. Special two. Or specials. It was not a fun fight until I was forced to learn how to evade it. Now, with uh, Claire, she nullifies and makes this fight so much easier. Now, you saw I just blocked it. You see how much damage the blocking takes. It's not much at all. So, it's just not worth trying to evade it when you could mistime it, when you could swipe and have your character just stand there it's just not worth it so instead i just block sometimes you know i can't help myself and i'll try to you know evade but uh it's just annoying you know i i really get annoyed with the inputs but i don't always talk about them because it just gets old. It just gets old. Um, but anyway, next fight, Moon Dragon. Now, when I went into this fight, I was kind of worried a little bit. Because I'm not used to fighting her. But going in with Nick Fury, I felt much safer. Because I figured, hey, I've got a whole nother life. If necessary. Okay. 
Um, but I'm seeing here she's going down, and unless she does something real crazy, and I, I don't mind the uh, unblockable on her SP1. Her SP1 reminds me of Spider-Gwen's old SP1, where it's not really doing anything to me, and I just wait it out, you know? So that, that was a pretty uh, easy fight. Um, I don't know if she becomes more difficult. If she's awakened, I really don't know. Now, we got Gore. Now, Gore is quite an annoying defender. And they gave him a rework, so he's even more annoying. Guess who eats him up? Claire. Now, I popped an invulnerability boost just in case, but every time I've fought Gore with Claire, it's been easy work, okay? So, just look at this. Nullifying. Oh, you want that regen? Okay, that's cool, that's cool. Because what's gonna happen, you know, I don't have uh, any of my charges, which is why I wasn't uh, nullifying it. Uh, but when I get to uh, special two, it's gonna be all over with. Okay, come on. There we go. Come on. Come on. There. He wants to use up all of that regen. But guess what? No more buffs now. And look at that. I'm at a special two already. Hey, let's do it again. Boom. And done. Yeah, easy work. Easy work. So, that was Gore against my girl, Claire. I do love Claire. She is so useful. All right, so middle. I wasn't messing with the middle. Um, somebody else already was assigned there, so they cleared that up. Uh, I used up, uh, I think, did I use some... Uh, no, 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 I didn't use up any energy. All right, so we're back and we are gonna fight this spot. And this is one of the reasons I brought in uh, Nick Fury. Nick Fury handles spot really well. I still don't know quite how to handle his kit. I really need to, to look into it a little bit more because once he has them spots, he got five spots. I don't know what to do. I don't know how to keep him from getting spots. Leave a comment below if you know. Um, the only thing I know to do is to try to get him down as fast as possible. So, you know, if, if there's a, a, a way to, you know, reduce or, or keep him from getting spots, I thought I saw, uh, can you punish like his heavy or special or something like that? I really need to look into it. But with uh, Nick Fury, not too worse. So I did a nice little heavy attack, put some bleeds on him. All right. And I don't really have to worry about the node because he doesn't get armor up. Now he's got one spot. Now he's got two. And I think it has something to do. Now he has four. Something to do maybe with the my ending attack. See, now he has five. At this point, I don't know what to do except what I just did, which is going to do damage to me. Okay? So I, I hit him, you know, while he was untouchable. And something I learned the hard way, it don't matter if he is stunned. You know, I, like, parried, and then I hit him, and he instantly attacks. In the middle of the stun. It cancels the stun. And I was like, what? So now that I know that, you know, I just basically uh, am prepared for it. So definitely leave a comment below if you know uh, how to fight him so that he doesn't get all of those uh, spots. So I'm not in that particular, situ uh, particular situation. Uh, now, if you guys have been watching me, you know about this fight. Uh, basically, anybody on here that gets armor ups... For every armor up, there's like a 30% chance to glance. So, you know, right now he has a 30% chance, so it's going pretty well. All right, now he's got a 60% chance to glance. 
okay? So, it can be a longish fight because of the glancing. Um, just annoying more than anything, okay? Just annoying. So, all I got to do is basically bait out. I don't care about his special two, really. Uh, I am shock immune. Now, a question. Do you guys know anybody that's shock immune that can remove the armors? Because usually on this node, I find folks that gain armor ups. So I'm just curious if there's anybody that's shock immune that you can recall that can uh, take those armors down because then I might start using them instead of Hulkling, even though he works just fine. All right. Now we've got the last fight of the war. And it is Ant-Man Future, who I just got and ranked up. And Hulkling is really good on this node. Because of the high energy diet, you don't want anybody that does energy attacks. And Hulkling does not. Look at these pierces that I'm, I got. And I had my uh, advanced power boost. All right. Look at that. Look at that. Unblockable. And I tried. It didn't work the way I was hoping it would just now. And then he parried me. I'm like, are you kidding me? So the way that was supposed to work, advanced power boost, and I was gonna go unblockable and then do this. That's what it was supposed to do a while back. But I wasn't able to get, it looked like my power was being, you know, uh, uh, reduced. My power game was being reduced. So even though I had the advanced power boost and I had the, you know, part, you know, uh, um, I guess power start one. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I had one bar of power. I wasn't able to get to two bars while I had that unblockable. It is what it is. But we got him down pretty quick. Anyway, uh, let us find out how this war ended. And we're back. And as you can see, we won this war pretty handily as well. As you can see here, this was a pretty, pretty, um, pretty good war for us. Uh, but anyway, that is going to do it, guys. Thank you for watching. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.